Welcome! This video is going to show you how to grade student assignments in Moodle. And this is assuming that you've already set up an assignment in Moodle. So we're grading official assignments that have been set up using the Moodle assignment feature. Um, and then we're also going to assume that you've already had some students go in and successfully submit their work. And so that's, that's what you're going to see here. If you do not already have an assignment set up in your Moodle site, click the video linked here or in the video description below to learn how to set up assignments in Moodle before you hit this grading step. Okay, so once you have an assignment set up and students have uploaded their submissions for the assignment, grading them in Moodle is actually pretty simple. From your Moodle main page, simply click into the assignment you want to grade. Um, so for example, this assignment right here has some student submissions. And this will give you a simple preview of how many students have already uploaded submissions. So that's right here. And how many you still need to grade. So this is a really nice way to just sort of keep track of where you're at with the class and get a pulse check on how many students you're still waiting on to submit and how much work you still need to do for grading. So from here, click View and Grade All Submissions to start grading the assignments. You'll notice this is a class of three, so my grading here is pretty easy. All right, so from this grade um, assignment grading page, you will see a list of all of your students and the status of each of their assignments. You can click on any of these headers to change how you sort the assignments. So you might want to sort the assignment by status, for example. You can see which ones are submitted or which ones aren't submitted. You can sort by first or last name by simply clicking on these options here. To grade a student, simply click Edit and then go ahead and grade. And you'll see the student's assignment grading page. And you'll actually even notice here that this student submitted their assignment late. Um, and so that you'll see that because we put a due date here, uh, Moodle keeps track really nicely and gives you this nice indicator and indicates to students who submitted their assignment late and who submitted on time. Okay, so from this grading page, you'll be able to actually look at the submission itself. And then you can go ahead and give the student a grade. You can also add some feedback comments. And if you want, and you made sure to select the feedback file option when you set up your assignment, you could also upload a feedback file here. You can click this and give the student some sort of Word, Word document response. Maybe you tracked changes in Word um, on their assignment and you want to upload that so they can view them. You could put that right here. And then you simply can either save changes and go back to the main student list that we just saw with all your students, or you can save and show next and view the next student's assignment to grade. So you'll see here's another student. This assignment was actually submitted early. You can view the assignment itself. You can give the student a grade. You can give them some comments if you'd like. And a feedback file and save the changes. I'm actually going to save the changes and go back to the main list. So that's really it. Um, it's actually pretty simple to just walk through each of the students one by one, save them, and show the next student, and grade as you go. One other thing you can do, uh, if it's easier, if you want to download all of the student submissions at once, you can go into this uh, menu at the top, this drop-in menu at the top, and download all student submissions. And this will simply save all of their submissions zipped up in a folder together, which is a really nice way to get all their students out of Moodle in a little more uh, rapid fashion. All right, that's it. Uh, whenever you submit and set up an assignment and then grade students in this way, these grades will also automatically show up in your Moodle gradebook. So all of these grades that have been submitted here will be showing up in the Moodle gradebook as well for students to see. And so if students themselves clicked into grades here, they would see those grades that you submitted for their assignments. Good luck grading student assignments and happy Moodling.